Next special EX is going to be Onigashima Zoro and I think there is a chance of Onigashima Zoro releasing on 11th of November. Why I think so? Let me tell you guys. Hey, this is Kavan. Welcome back to a new video of One Piece Bounty Dash, and we just got 50 gems from Film Red North America release celebration reward. But our main topic on this video is which character can be a special EX like Yamato. On this anniversary, on 3.5 anniversary, there were two EX. Usually, there were only one EX in half yearly anniversary, but this time there were two. So, on this one, there is a possibility that it can be four EX also, like. Last year it was 3x, so this time they're increasing more and more vx, so it can be 4x. If not even 4, there can be 3x too. And I think that best time to release the ex on his birthday will be like really right idea. Why I think so? Cause they just released Yamato and Uta. You know these two waifus are broken as fuck, and they are literally strong. At this time, I know like you guys will hate that no way Zoro can come at this time or Zoro is going to come on 11th of November, it's too soon. But hear me out. Why I think so he's especially EX and why I think it can be a possibility that he's re getting released on 11th of November or maybe on December start. Reason, a lot of people use their gems on Yamato or Uta and cause of course the same and why foods broken. They are literally these both of these two characters are really good and if Onigashima Zoro gets released at this time there will be people will have like literally no gems at all and they're releasing both of these broken characters at the same time can be a trap or bait for us to use our gems on these banners so boom out of nowhere Zoro banner comes and we have like literally no gems at all what P2W players will do at that time they will use money and if F2P players are also thinking about using the money they are also going to use the money just to summon for Onigashima Zoro that will be a like perfect business plan for Bandai to get a lot of money though so there is a possibility that Bandai can do that cause a lot of people don't have that many gems if they summon on Uta and Yamato and both of these two are really broken so releasing Zoro at this time would be like really nice business plan uh, i doubt that there is any banner ending on 11 of november but that can be a surprise for everyone that no one has gems at that time and like what what's he gonna do you have to use money if you need onigashima zorota or you have to just skip that character i doubt that people will skip that character that came like it's been almost two years since, since a new zoro came so I doubt that people will do so it can be a nice business strategy though no cap it can be a really nice business strategy what I think that there is a other character that can come with Zorotho let me show you all that there is a possibility and a lot of people were guessing that it can be king too I mean king is strong he's really good but hear me out I doubt that king is going to get released reason cause king is good but we didn't got a new Zoro from like two years and I I think like a lot of people are waiting for Onigashima Zoro rather than waiting for King though. No hate, no hate. But I think Onigashima Zoro will give more profit to Bandai and it's on 11th of November, it's Zoro's birthday. So releasing at that time when Uta and Yamato already got released, a lot of people use their gems. It can be a nice strategy for Bandai to releasing Zorotho. So I doubt that King can get released, but King is really good getting released as a bounty fest or EX at this time though. And it's going on Wano right now. So maybe, maybe King can be a bounty fest counter or anything like that. But I doubt that he will be a special EX. I think it has to be Onigashima Zoro. Uh, it has to be Onigashima Zoro. But King is really good. I would not say that he is like not good enough to be ex he is good enough to be a ex no cap but i still doubt that king will be ex rather than zoro being an ex because you know what onigashima zoro did on anime i don't even have to tell you guys but you guys know but nah 
Zoro has more chances, bro. This Ashura Zoro, this will be like sick as fuck if it gets released on this game. Now, I mean, like, people will start playing this game again more and more, and a lot of new players will come if Onigashima Zoro gets released on OPBR though. So it will be a nice strategy. And if they release it nice right now on 11 of November, it can be like nice business strategy also. So both ways, it's good. Uh, it can release on December 2 or maybe at the end of November but on 11 of November it can be a really nice strategy like no gems people has to use money but later on also it has to be Zoro only I doubt that there can be any other EX that can be a special EX rather than Zoro now why I'm saying that he's going to be special EX why not main EX a lot of people say on comment section that Onigashima Zoro will be the main EX, the strongest EX. Special EX is also really strong, guys. First of all, I'm gonna tell you guys that Yamato is really strong. Yamato is really good. The surprise EX on 3.5 anniversary Zephyr. Zephyr is also really strong. So it's nothing like main EX or anything like that. If we talk about two EX coming at the same time, like usually on fourth of anniversary, like Kaido and Luffy came on 3rd anniversary, it has to be a link on yearly anniversary though to get released. If you start from the start, Blackbeard and Shanks had a connection, you know, their fight, the scratch and everything. It was a hot topic at that time. Then if I talk about the second one, Odin and Roger, they were on the same boat, so it was like that. Then Kaido and Luffy, they were fighting with each other. At this time also, Zoro is good but zoro need a competitor or someone that has to be like with him like zoro and luffy can get released but i doubt that is going to be cause there is hybrid kaido too hybrid kaido is main villain and luffy i ain't gonna talk about the spoilers but you know the new luffy you know what luffy is doing on ain't gonna say but you know what he is doing and it's Luffy versus Kaido. So new Luffy and Kaido. Main villain and main character will get released together. Because they have main character versus main villain right now in anime. So Bandai is going to make that as main focus. I ain't saying that Zoro is bad. Or Zoro is not going to enough to be the main EX. But surprise EX is also good. So stop saying that surprise EX is not as good as main EX. It's nothing like that. It's just that they just need a link or something that is going on anime to just make more hype because those two characters are getting released at the same time. So I doubt that Onigashima Zoro and the new Luffy are going to get released together. I mean, they are going to get released together, but Onigashima Zoro will be a surprise EX or special EX and then the new EX will be the new Luffy and hybrid Kaido. It can be possible, but we will talk about that on the other video. And there are other EX also that I think can be the next EX. We will talk about that also, but on a different video. But yeah, this guy is a special or surprise EX. You can see the, this is like this guy is crazy, literally crazy. Now, there is no way this character getting released and no one summoning on it. It will be a nice strategy, nice plan for Bandai, no cap. This will be good, really, really good, Zoro. Three sword stars and Mazoro. Nah, and Mazoro will be like goated, literally goated, literally goated. If you see, it's been like almost two years. The last Zoro that got released was on 19th of December. We got the teaser on, and on 20th of December, I think they got released. It's been almost two years, like only one month or like one and a half month to go for this corrective not being on the game for almost two years. I think it's time for Z new Zoro to come on this game. It has to be Onigashima Zoro. And the last EX, uh, surprise EX we got was on 18th of December. And at the end of January, we got the two other new EX, Luffy and Kaido. So it can be like that. Again, surprise EX first, then the two new EX at the same time. It can be like that. But let's see. You already know this Onigashima Zoro. We got this picture on internet and it was a crazy hype at that time but they did release Zephyr instead of Zoro but at this time if they there are not a lot of characters that should be EX at this time when anime is going on 
right now there is like only few characters that deserve to be ex and onigashima zoro is one of them so i think onigashima zoro will be a surprise or special ex like yamato and the other two ex you know i read kaido luffy and there are other characters also i don't want to give the spoilers of the new video on this video only but i will talk about that what i think what characters can be the main ex on fourth of anniversary and surprise ex we already know i mean uh that it was not a surprise ex but yeah this is surprise ex what you guys think about onigashima zoro do you think that he can get released on 11 of november or on this month or maybe on december what you think when onigashima zoro will get released and do you think that he will be the ex surprise ex or not and are you guys still think that he will be the main ex i literally explained why he is going to be surprise ex rather than being a main ex there is no week or anything like that it's just about the link and everything but yeah you can comment anything that you are thinking i don't mind but this character is going to be crazy when this character comes how many gems you are going to save for onigashima zoro how many gems you have right now you guys already used gems on yamato uta or you guys already had a hint about onigashima zoro or other ex are you guys gonna skip this character i mean literally you guys gonna skip this character for the other two ex Tell me everything on the comment section. So that's it for the video and thanks for watching this video. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more OPB content, hint seeks, videos like that. And tell me on the comment section what you guys think about Onigashima Zoro. And are you guys hyped for this character? How many gems you saved and everything about that. Bye guys, bye bye. <laughs>